The Kardashian name is a billion-dollar empire that doesn't show any signs of slowing down. But will Kim K and company still be seeking the spotlight in their golden years? If so, we know what they'll probably look like thanks to the viral wonders of FaceApp. Kim Kardashian has taken motherhood in stride, but the reality star admitted she worries about getting older every single day during a candid interview with The Cut, saying, "...there's a sense of calmness and wisdom you get from life, but it also just sucks." Despite her concerns, Kim still looks amazing after deciding to drastically overhaul her diet and workout regimen after some unflattering photos of her post-pregnancy body popped up online in 2017. She revealed on The View, "...I get up every morning between 5.30 and 6, work out before my kids get up. That's fine when you're still under 40, but will she still be hitting the gym in her 70s? Honestly, it wouldn't surprise us." While she doesn't look it, Kourtney Kardashian turned 40 in 2019 and celebrated the milestone with a star-studded bash that was attended by musicians French Montana, Robin Thicke, and Sia. Kourtney looked stunning in her vintage Versace gown, but she admitted that getting older was causing her anxiety. I do think that turning 40, like it almost makes you analyze like where you're at in your life. The Poosh founder has nothing to worry about if FaceApp is anything to go by. She's going to look much better than most of us will at 80. Has Khloe Kardashian been aging in reverse? At 35, the youngest Kardashian sister has managed to pull off the illusion of getting younger every year since she adopted an intense skincare routine, essential if you want to stay fresh-looking in the California heat. She told W Magazine, "...it's so important to protect your skin from the sun. I can never emphasize it enough." I even keep sunscreen in my glove compartment. Some people don't realize that you're still highly exposed even when you're inside of your car. However, no amount of sunscreen can stop Father Time in his tracks. Here's what 75 will look like for Chloe. Kendall is often credited as the most naturally beautiful of the Kardashian-Jenner brood, reportedly avoiding surgery and cosmetic procedures to keep her model looks intact. Will she stick to this philosophy as she gets older? Time will tell, but one thing we do know is that she finds the idea of getting old daunting. She told the Sunday Times, "...it's scary. Life is scary. You can see both Chris and Caitlyn Jenner in their daughter, and when you age her by 40 years, her parents' genetic influence becomes even more apparent." The youngest, kinda self-made billionaire in the world comes from the Kardashian-Jenner clan. Kylie Jenner's Kylie Cosmetics is expected to generate $1 billion in lifetime sales by 2022. Critics of the makeup guru claim that she isn't actually self-made, but Jenner refutes this, telling E! News, "...I did not get money from my parents past the age of 15. Not a dime in my bank account is inherited, and I am very proud of that." We're sure having a reality TV show and a safety net helped a little, though. Older skin requires a different approach when it comes to makeup, however, so Jenner will have to adapt if she wants to stay on fleek into her 60s. Kris Jenner will be in triple figures in 40 years' time, but would you really be that surprised to see her hit that milestone? The Kardashian matriarch has continued to give age the finger into her 60s and give women half her age a run for their money. But the Kardashian-Jenner momager is well aware that she can't lead the pack forever. Tears were shed in a 2019 episode of Keeping Up with the Kardashians when Jenner agreed to let daughter Kim Kardashian spearhead the family's annual Christmas Eve party, something she's taken great pride in for a long time. You're outnumbered. Well, that makes me sad. Will she still be attending parties when she's 103? We're gonna say probably. Will Caitlyn Jenner still be around in 40 years' time at the age of 109? It would be no mean feat, but then again, she was an Olympic gold medal-winning, record-breaking athlete, so fitness and endurance are in her blood. This Jenner is determined to live life to the fullest in what she described as the fourth quarter of her life during an interview with The Guardian, saying, "...I thought, I'm going to do this before my 40s. I'm not going to be an old chick. I don't want to be an old chick. And I got to 39 and I couldn't do it." She was 65 when she finally decided to transition, and she's not looking back. Looking forward, anything is possible when you have access to the best doctors in the world. The subject of aging rarely comes up when Kanye West sits down for an interview, largely because there's a long list of other topics he'd like to discuss. I just told you who I thought I was! A god! Kim Kardashian's baby daddy is now in his 40s, but the producer and rapper has discussed the pitfalls of getting older, telling Rolling Stone in 2007, "...I hate my 30s. It's going to take me a while to get used to it. I envy people who like getting older because I don't." We don't know what he's so worried about. Grandpa Kanye looks pretty cool to us. Rob Kardashian is an often overlooked member of this famous fam. 
He appeared in some of the earliest episodes of Keeping Up with the Kardashians, but he dropped off the radar in recent years. After his 2016 spin-off show, Rob in China, he's reportedly struggled with his weight, and even though he dropped some pounds with the help of his family, he's become a Hollywood recluse. He reappeared on Instagram in 2019 after being banned from the platform in 2017 when he posted controversial images of his former fiancé and baby mama, Black China. Reportedly, his account is now being run by his mom's company, Jenner Communications. At this rate, the next time we see Rob, he could look like this. Check out one of our newest videos right here! Plus, even more Nicki Swift videos about your favorite celebs are coming soon. Subscribe to our YouTube channel and hit the bell so you don't miss a single one.